Auburn, come on, let's get going. First day of the season is here and you don't want to be late. Oh, you look so cute. Okay, stay right there. I'm gonna get your Birmingham Bowl participation trophy. Okay, got your NIL money? Yeah. Oh, did you remember to pack the football only facility? It should be almost done. Yeah. Hey, you didn't eat your Pop-Tarts. Are you okay? I don't know. What's up? Nothing. Are you nervous about the new season starting? No. Well, maybe a little. It's okay to be nervous. You have untested coordinators, new players in key positions, and a starting kicker coming off an ACL tear. Yeah, but all the other SEC teams are like really super good. Even Vanderbilt's putting up 60 off the mainland. Oh, well, I see. It's just that you know my passions lie with basketball and baseball now. Hey, you know what? You're good too. I am? Well, maybe a little thin at quarterback and definitely at offensive line, but yeah, you are good. Yeah, but it's just that people have been saying super mean things about how I'm gonna do and it hurts my feelings and I don't like it. Who said mean things? The media. What do we say about what the media thinks? That the click-based internet consuming economy drives media in a more alarmist, and headline-grabbing direction. That's right. But they all picked us to finish last, even worse than Mississippi State. Even though they beat us and scored 40 unanswered points, they still super suck. I tell you what, I know you're nervous. You got the big Penn State game coming up, so let's lose the Pop-Tarts for breakfast and start off the season with a little treat. How's that? Good. Two would be better. But that's it. Any more cupcakes and the season ticket holders will be in total revolt over the lack of quality home games. You're the best, Mom. I don't care what the boosters say. Bye! Oh, have a great first week! Seven and five. Best case scenario. This episode was brought to you by Renaissance Bank, understanding you.